Hey guys, what's going on? It's your boy Saglitch, aka Sag. Today I'm bringing you some more draft champions. We are still with the same team as the previous week. We have, of course, our boy Jason Taylor, Travis Frederick, Ryan Tannehill, Lee or Mike Evans, and many more to choose from. Let's get into it. As you can see here, 80 offense, 81 defense. We are, uh, we are both. Balance on the offense and defensive side. Our opponents rock in Torrey Holt from 2000 Rams, uh, Vontae Davis, and Wagner for the left, or excuse me, right tackle, I want to say. But regardless, shut down corner, great receiver. Let's see how our defense holds, where of course we got the 2000 Jason Taylor from the Miami Dolphins, Gerald McCoy, and like I said before, Travis Frederick. He likes to run cross wheels and man up 3D, where we rock the Browns cross and man up 3D, which again, defense is a touch and go. But we're here from Orlando, Florida at Zilker Stadium. Let's get into draft champions. The Atlanta Falcons taking on the Indiana Colts. The kick is up and back past the mid part of the end zone, taking a knee is Tyron Matthew. Ace formation, drop back the throw over the middle, just taking a shot and right away, an interception for Deshaun Gibson. So, of course, we got Shady McCoy, who's going to take it left side. He's going to run the ball pretty, uh, pretty good bit for this offense. But, of course, we're calling the Browns cross. Tannehill gets the ball off in time, but unfortunately unable to hit his tight end. Greg Olson, third and six. Tight bunch set for the shotgun set. Over to the right to, of course, Mike Evans, the big, massive bodied wide receiver. And we take it pitch left to Shady, who gets taken down for a one yard loss. Drop back throw from Tannehill. Tannehill's rolling out of the pocket, getting chased. Gives chase. Tight end open. Tight ends missed. Greg Olson had the opening, but Tannehill just missed. The ball by inches. Trips left set. Cross and wrap over the middle. Tannehill's watching it. And Tannehill's going to take off. He's got a defender. Uh, and the ball is stripped. But Shady McCoy is able to pick it up right away. Standing near the pile. Getting the ball back. 28 yard line. The weak side dive. And Shady McCoy is getting to the third. Or excuse me, that was Riddick running the ball. He's getting to the third level, and he got the first down. Two back set. Tannehill's rolling out, buying some time. Oh, 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 oh. wide receiver just gets away from the linebacker. He controls him, brings him up. Wide receiver gets free for that little bit of window that Tannehill's able to hit. So the following kickoff. And the kick is very short at about the 12-yard line received. And taking it up to almost the 30 is the return man. Trips left set. Over to the left side with Manziel. And wow, what a catch. What a catch. We got Torrey Holt, one-on-one -on -one coverage. He makes the incredible catch. Drop back over the middle. Over to the right, just <laughs> gets drilled. He's just... Lining them up, running four wide, looks like. And the tight end is taken down immediately after that short gain. I believe that's Owen Daniels, if I'm not mistaken. A play action over to the left side and hits Torrey Holt going out of bounds at the 15. Wide receiver in motion. Manziel drops back, tries to hit that corner route. And intercepted is Manziel and Johnson. With the interception. Two back set. Shotgun set for Tannehill. Trying to get away from the safety. Just a quick dump off to the right side. And look at Riddick getting off field for an 11-yard gain. Getting this team out of danger. Two back set again. Slip screen set up left. And McCoy's got some room diving. And just hit hard on the play for a 9-yard gain. All set right side for McCoy who takes it left and gets the first down, a gain of four. Bunch set. 
Tannehill drops back over to the left, and he hits Greg Olson crossing across for a 10-yard gain in a first down. We're getting this as a quick no huddle offense. We got less than a minute or less than two minutes left on the first half clock. Tannehill drops back over to the left, hits Patton for the crossing, and Patton's taken down immediately for a three yard gain. Again, same play, opposite side, hits Patton once again, dragging the round and zooming out of bounds is Patton for a 10 yard gain. Looks like this coach likes this play call, so we're going to keep running it. And finally taken down is Tannehill, the immediate timeout afterwards, given a minute 30 left on the clock. Drops back the throw, and taken down immediately, fumble on the play, but recovered by the offensive line. And as you can see here, we're going to the booth review, and the ruling is overturned. So we were down before giving up the ball. Trips right, set up screen left is McCoy. McCoy's got some room, cutting back. Getting away from one defender and just not enough blocking on the play. Gain of 14, but that creates a punt with the clock running. 27 seconds left to go. The kick is up by Roca or Rocco, however you want to say it. And Burley's coming back, trying to get at the guy. Tyron Matthews finally taken down after a gain of, I believe, 15. Nickelback set to off coverage, the two back spell set. The play action from Menzel. And taken down immediately is Menzel by who else? Vic Beasley Jr. 12 seconds left on the clock. And the pass is up and just overthrows the receiver. Not even close. And excuse me, not Menzel here. We are playing Matt Ryan. My apologies to Matty Ice. And just over the middle in the triple coverage. And looks like Jimmy Smith's going to get the interception. He's got an opening. No seconds left in the first half. And Jimmy Smith for the interception for a touchdown. Momentum swing. And that is going to be all she wrote for the first half. Believing that it's going to be an onside kick. We set up for the onside return. They decide to kick off in the kickoff formation. And the kick is up. Booted back to the end zone towards the very beginning of the end zone. So Goodwin's going to take it back. Take it over to the right middle side and take it down at the 25. Uh, I formation, two, right, or two receivers set right. And McCoy's just dancing around getting a five-yard gain. Two back set, second and five. McCoy going over to the right side, creating a bunch formation. Screen setting up across the middle, and McCoy gets it, but is taken down, cannot get to his blockers, only a two-yard gain. Third and three, bunch set for this offense, and Tannehill just going to throw it over to the right side to Greg Olson and gets a first down. Pistol formation, the dive, and reading the blocks going upfield to the 49-yard line is McCoy. Tannehill drops back over to the left side, hits Olsen, crossing across. And this team is making dangerous plays with these crossing routes. Patton and Olsen both targeted for the crossing routes. And just right now, second and eight. You guys slip screen, step up right side, hit as he's caught, and a gain of two. So third and six. Another bunch right, uh, shotgun formation. I wonder what play it is. We already know. Tannehill drops back, leaves the receiver open, gets away from a defender, and Patton in for his second score on the game and Tannehill's second touchdown throw, giving it a, we called it back in college and back in high school, a skunk, 21-0 lead against this Indianapolis Colts team. Four minutes left on the clock in the kickoff. What are they going to do? They're going to take it out of the end zone. And uh, wasn't a bad choice. Uh, got to the 23, and he's going to go with a one-back set, one tight end, three wide receivers. So it looks like 11 personnel out there. Matty Ice drops back, and almost intercepted was Matty Ice once again. And we are getting a pause. Could this be it? Gentlemen, start your engines. And, oh, do we get it? Oh, he might just make it. Nope. 
He's not. Is he quitting? Is he? Are we going out of a rage quit? Come on. He's got like 15 seconds to decide. Oh, God. The intensity. And, guys, that is going to be it. He does concede in the game. We get another win under our belt. We are a 3 0 team. We might be going to the Super Bowl, quote unquote, Super Bowl. That being said, I hope you leave a like if you did. Comment if you want. Subscribe if you haven't. Check in the description below for other Draft Champions videos. I'll see you next time. Peace.